Hi, welcome to Lazada University, hub for e-commerce education. In this video, we will show you how to process an order in Seller Center. First, please log in to your SC account. Lazada makes it easy for you to keep track of orders in your Seller Center account. Expect to receive an email notice for every customer's ordered item from your shop. However, we strongly recommend that you check regularly your shop's orders in Seller Center, ideally first thing in the morning and then for every succeeding two hours. Remember, if your product is out of stock or wrongly priced or cannot be fulfilled for any reason within Lazada's standard lead time, the order must be cancelled. Also bear in mind that it is not possible to get in touch with customers and offer them other products or solutions. That's why you should always keep your stocks up to date. In this way, you will avoid cancellations and make your customers happy. Order processing starts with picking the ordered item from your storage area. Then, proceed on to pack the items according to Lazada standards to avoid any possible damages to the product during transportation. For a quick guide on how to properly pack orders, please check out Lazada University. After packing the order, please proceed to do the following. 1. Print the shipping label. 2. Update the status of the order to ready to ship within 24 hours. 3. Drop off the parcel to the nearest 3PL branch. In Seller Center, all your orders will appear in the Orders Overview tab and will be visible in the Pending tab. To view, go to Orders, Manage Orders, and click on Ready to Ship. If you want to see more details, you can click the plus sign on each order to see the following. Customer Information, Seller SKU, Product Image. Select the delivery provider that you intend to use. One. Skynet, GDEX, Post Lajou for prepaid orders. 2. Takbin and Ninja Van for cash on delivery orders. After that, click Create Package. Print a copy of the tax invoice following this format. 1. A4 size paper. 2. Portrait form. You will get a check sign in green as a notification upon tax invoice. Next, click Ready to Ship. This will generate automated tracking ID. Click on Shipping Label. Shipping Label contains payment method, customer information, and seller information. Print four copies of the shipping label. Place one inside a plastic pouch, then Stick the other one on the package's exterior. Print four copies of shipping labels. Stick receiver copy on the package. Insert POD and billing in the plastic pouch and stick on the package. The last copy will be for your own reference. Print the shipping label by following this format. 1. Landscape form. 2. A5 size paper. It is important to follow this printing format to make sure barcode is clearly displayed on the shipping label. Next, in Seller Center, click on Ready to Ship. Do not get confused the first time when you click on Ready to Ship. It is to generate automated tracking ID. The second time when you click on Ready to Ship, it is to change order status from Pending to Ready to Ship. Next. Drop off the package at your respective drop-off location. For sellers who need pickup service, please reach out to PSC or Partner Support Center. Remember, if you are availing of the pickup service, you must print out the carrier manifest. To do this, 1. Go to Ready to Ship tab. 2. Click on the checkboxes of the respective orders. 3. Select Print. 4. Print two copies of the carrier manifest for the selected item. 5. Give one copy to the courier and keep the other for your record. Please take note that the 3PL or third-party logistics should provide you with a copy of package slip. Keep this for future reference. 
Once the 3PL confirms that the products have been picked up, Lazada will update the order status from ready to ship to shipped. Next, fill out the customer's name and shipping address on the consignment note. Remember, you can always track your order by entering order number on order's overview page. Once the customer receives the product, the order status will change to delivered. Take note that only orders with delivered status are qualified for payment. Here are more helpful tips in managing your orders. Remember, the Manage Orders page shows you only the pending orders by default, but you can also view your orders with other filters such as shipped orders. Alternatively, you can export a list of all your orders in CSV format by clicking Export button in the Orders Overview page. Please remember to ship your package orders as soon as possible. If an order is not shipped within Lazada's required lead time, it will be cancelled. Do not consolidate two orders in one shipment. For large or numerous products that cannot fit inside one box, you will need to click on the plus sign on Order Overview page. Please take note that each of the products has its own ready to ship button. Make sure that you click on all of them and to print out all the necessary documents mentioned earlier. Always ask your 3PL for a POD or proof of delivery for each shipment. It's the only document that will validate delivery of your orders. Take note that any cancellation or late shipment will be penalized. How fast you do order fulfillment according to Lazada standards is one of the key drivers to a happy and fulfilling customer experience. Follow these tips to become a successful Lazada merchant and partner today. Thank you for watching this video and happy selling!